Okay, let's get a check now of your weather and traffic conditions here in central Alabama with Storm Track meteorologist Ashley Gann. And Ashley, we've been talking about this since four o'clock this morning, but you warned us about the snow coming earlier in the week. Yeah, absolutely. So now what I, this is what I call now casting. We spent the whole week forecasting what was to come. Now we're looking at what is. So here's a look at our storm track radar currently. We're looking at a mix of rain from Anniston all the way back through Tuscaloosa. Snowfall kind of along and north of I-20, but snow is also beginning to fall in Clanton. It's really a matter of where the cold air is mixing with this rain, and that's where we're seeing some changeover. If you'll notice on the maps here, Alabaster to Clear is still dealing with the rain in the liquid state as you move north. Kind of a mixed bag. You've got some sleet from Hueytown to the Gallery over towards Chelsea. More snow, and that's what we're seeing from Birmingham, um, even over towards Parrish to our west. Tuscaloosa, Tuscaloosa, the city of Tuscaloosa, seeing rain, but Tuscaloosa County, the northern half of the county, dealing with a little bit of snow right now. And we're continuing to monitor the conditions in East Alabama. It looks like things are beginning to quiet down just a little bit over towards Gadsden. We'll continue tracking this. I do have some information that may be important for you over the next 24 hours. That's coming up in your Storm Track seven day forecast. But right now, let's see if this snow is impacting the roads with Rachel and your real time traffic. Thank you, Ashley. The visibility definitely decreased. You can see that. From our BJCC camera. Here's I-2059. This is the southbound side right near the airport. That's where our camera is pointed to from the BJCC. Good news is we're still accident free and hopefully we can keep it that way with fewer people out on the roads due to these dangerous weather conditions. So we'll continue to keep you posted all across our viewing area on the interstates and highways. Get ahead over to Tuscaloosa. I'll show you a camera there in just a minute.